Hello, and welcome to Cookie, Cookie Recommends, Recommends, where you can win a prize by guessing what we will rate your favorite fast foods. I'm Doughboy Dad, and with me I have... Silly Killer. Today we're at Wendy's, trying their new Cinna Cinnabon Pull-Apart Bread. It's like a cinnamon bun in pieces with then with frosting on it. Uh, so uh, let's see uh, how let's see what we rate it, and then let's see who wins because they guessed the rating that we that we were gonna give this. All, All right. right. Here, uh, grab a piece. Oh, I see. So this is a piece right here. Looks like a kind of like a piece of a cinnamon roll. It has frosting on it. Hmm. That is pretty good. Good. It's essentially, like what I what I would expect a, a cinnamon roll roll to taste like. But that's good. Yeah, it tastes exactly like a cinnamon roll, but it's kind of like it's in pieces. And it's in it, and mm. I I do want to try a bit more of the frosting to test its sweetness, like. And and I think what is good about this, and compared to a regular cinnamon roll, is a regular cinnamon roll. You know, it's bulky, and if you're trying to, let's say you go through a drive-through and you get a cinnamon roll, it can be really messy because you have nothing to hold it in. This is in a nice little cup, so you can eat it with a fork, and you can drive and eat. And not have to worry about it getting all over the place. Yeah, it is. It is very edible, and that's. Um, it has that type of convenience. But about the about the actual flavor, I really don't don't have a lot to say. I mean, I can taste the the the. It, but it's good. Like the like the bread is light. The the cinnamon is is present, um, in mm -hmm. its flavor. Um, the. The frosting isn't particularly sweet nor light. This is like this is an entirely solid cinnamon roll. Yeah, yeah, it ha I agree with you. The texture of the of the dough of the of the cooked dough the the bond the is is perfect. It's you know soft and a little a little bit chewy, but not not too bad. You know, I mean that's the way it should be. Um, the frosting is delicious. The cinnamon inside is great. So, yeah, I have almost no complaints. It's it's like a convenient in a convenient a convenient cinnamon roll. That's basically what it is. I have no problem with it. All right, silly killer, your final thoughts. Yeah. So for the cinnamon roll, I think it's I think it is actually very good. Um, I don't think it's close enough to a five. Like it didn't it didn't blow me away. It wasn't over the top. Um, so I think I would give it a very a very solid four um, for a very solid dish. Yeah. And for me, I thought it was amazing. Um, it was just like a cinnamon roll but in a convenient form like i would actually prefer cinnamon rolls like this if if i had a choice between a regular cinnamon roll and this i'd choose this because you know you can it just it's just easier to eat in a, in a way um that and but um so i would give it a a five on a scale of one to five but right. we're not the final deciders our moderator cookie monster has been listening and he's going to um, uh, uh, decide what the final rating will be. Cookie, would you whisper in my ear a rating of one to five? Thank you. So Cookie rates it a four. Get it soon. This is a high four. It's like, it's almost a Cookie Recommends, but not quite. So uh, if you are looking for something for breakfast... If you're driving by a Wendy's, certainly try this. Do you have any comments to say? Yeah, um, we 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 were discussing this, and we and we thought that it should be more like a four point five. Like I, I was really on on the edge between four and five because it is a better cinnamon roll. Uh, yeah, so I, I would definitely recommend the uh, the cinnamon pull apart from Wendy's. Yeah, it's uh, it's uh, definitely a good thing. Now before uh, before we announce the winner, we want to say. Thank you to the workers at Wendy's uh, for making this making this food. We really appreciate your service. Thank you. And now let's see who won the prize by put
putting in a comment that got closest to our rating in the last video list, listed up here. And the winner is the person who got the closest rating in this last video, Robert French 6206. Now, we don't have the kind of budget on this show to uh, to give out iPhones or Apple Watches or Xboxes. Instead, we have the greatest tre treasure of all, wisdom. So, silly killer, please pull out a proverb, a personal proverb right. for Robert uh, Robert Let's see what French. This is gonna be. Life is like a bowl of alphabet soup. You never know what word you're gonna spell out. But you can bet it'll be a mix of nonsense and unexpected delights. So this is this is the proverb. All right, Robert French, that is your personal proverb for you to take to the bank. No one can take it from you. Now, viewers, if you would like to win a prize, please like, subscribe, and comment below about what you think will rate the next item we try in on Cookie Recommends. Now, one of our biggest fans, Elizabeth, uh, asked us to do foot-long dippers so, from Subway. So please comment below on a scale of one to five what you think will rate foot-long dippers. The chicken and cheese dipper uh, is what we're going to try. All right. So please comment below and hit the bell to turn on notifications. And finally, I hope you have a great night. Bye. Bye.